Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve high DPC latency on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So DPC stands for Deferred Procedure Call, and it allows you to perform high priority tasks first and low priority tasks later on your computer. So it basically just manages your tasks that are going on in the background to deliver optimal performance. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys, on how to resolve the issue. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing I'd recommend doing would be to open up the search menu, type in Control Panel. Best result should come back with Control Panel. So go ahead and open that up. Sort your view by by large icons. And then you want to select the Power Options button. Let's go ahead and left-click on that. Underneath Preferred or Additional Plans, if you don't see it, you want to select the High Performance Plan which favors performance but may use more energy. This is more relevant if you're using a laptop that it will drain your battery life faster. If you're on a desktop, the results are negligible on power consumption. So in most cases, if you're having an issue with performance, turn on the high performance setting, at least when you need a lot of resources to perform whatever tasks you are having issues with. So that's one thing I'd recommend selecting there. Something else we can try as well, if you go click the back arrow up here at the top, and you want to select the Network and Sharing Center now. So go ahead and left click on that option. And select where it says Change Adapter Settings. Select your network adapter from the list here. And then just double click on it. Select the Properties button. And then select where it says Internet Protocol Version 6. And then parentheses TCP slash IPv6. Try turning that off. Just uncheck that and then select OK and then see if that resolves the problem as well. So again, that's something else for you to try. One final thing we can try here as well, if you close out of here, open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match, or come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, select yes. And now I will have a command in the description of my video here, guys. I want you to copy it. it starts with BCD edit. And then just go ahead and copy that and then go up the top bar of the command prompt window here. Right click on it, select edit and paste that in. Hit enter. Should come back with the operation completed successfully. Once that's done, go ahead and close out of here. And then you want to restart your computer. So then hopefully at this point you should be good to go. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do about as it will help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.